Greetings, everyone. I am Terry Naturally, and I am the host of the Terry Talks Nutrition website, and also the host of the Terry Talks Nutrition radio show. I'd just like to have you understand a little bit more who I am, and I have a huge passion for helping to educate anyone who wants to listen as to have better health, better vitality, and reverse many diseases and prevent diseases, all by food, and filling the gap of those foods, of the loss of nutrients because of the lack of nutrients in our soil, and the way our crops are grown today. But we can fill in those gaps with botanical medicines, natural medicines that do not have side effects, and also vitamins and minerals, which we are in most need of. Drugs do not make us healthy. They may save lives in time, but they really do not provide any ability to improve and reverse diseases. And doctors don't have any ability to change our lives in terms of health. They do not understand health, food, and the education of you in terms of how to prevent and reverse diseases with food and nutrition. Out of all their years in med school, they have a couple of hours on health and nutrition. So my whole emphasis and influence and passion is to help you understand how you can make changes if you follow a few ideas through diet and nutrition. So at the beginning of this year, 2021, I made a resolution to write 10 books this year. Well, I have finished five, and one more just recently being published through our new company, Terry Talks Nutrition LLC, for a publishing company to put out books for you to have a better education. I'm spending with you about 15 minutes a day. Not really enough time to really have an impact on your health. But I hope I kind of nudge you or somehow influence you to start thinking about your diet and your health because drugs are not the answer. Drugs may save lives in time, but they're not going to change your life. So I'm writing books that have a greater impact so that you're going to sit down and read them and understand more about them. So I have experts that have joined me. So Andrew Grathis, one of the most powerful natural medicines that have an effect on many different diseases to prevent those diseases and reverse them. For example, cold and flu, upper respiratory tract infection, joint pain, arthritis, diabetes, heart conditions, liver disease, cancer, and much, much more. I wrote this book with Dr. Alexander Pernosian, who is an expert in adaptogens. Then I wrote a book on how to relieve pain, reverse pain, stop pain. I wrote this book with Dr. Jan McBaron. This is a very powerful book on how you can stop pain now. Then I wrote a book on a very powerful seed, and that seed is grape seed extract, and it can prevent and reverse cancer, heart disease, diabetes, Alzheimer's disease, and much more. Then I wrote a book on type 2 diabetes, because you know, actually, diabetes type 2 is optional. People that have type 2 diabetes, have a sugar problem, not diabetic. They are eating too much sugar without having enough insulin, which is a natural hormone that the body produces, to take that sugar into the cellular level and produce energy. So we're eating more sugar than the insulin is able to manage and control and regulate. Then I wrote a book on today's subject, melatonin. Now I know you're all going to say, yeah, I know about melatonin. It helps people sleep better. Well, that's only one little factor about melatonin. Melatonin is a multifunctional molecule that has a huge effect on almost every metabolic function in our body. It's a molecule that is produced by many cells in the body, even in the eyes, but also in the pineal gland in the brain, and it's produced in the absence of light. So when a darkness comes on during the day, 
later in the day, and darkness comes on by sunset, our pineal gland starts secreting melatonin. It's to the point where melatonin is one of the most critical factors involved in our health. There are over 28,000 studies on melatonin. 10,000 of those studies are on sleep disorders. 18,000 studies are on how to answer the aging problem. Are we getting older? Why are we getting older? Melatonin is one of those factors that is a very powerful antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, which prevents the aging process and many, many diseases, immune health, cancer, and much more. There are so many reasons why we should be taking melatonin. We take vitamin D every day, or most people do take vitamin D every day. It's a substance that our body produces, but because of our aging process and because of the change of diet, we don't produce enough vitamin D. The same is true of melatonin. As we get older, we are producing less melatonin over a period of time. And we need melatonin. I think any substance that is produced by the body, that means cholesterol, means vitamin D, melatonin, if the body is producing it, that means it is critical for our body function. Although over time, and because of diseases, we are producing less of these nutrients, so it's always good to take them in a dosage daily, preferably just before you go to bed at night, because that's when it's normally secreted in nature. Follow nature. Mimic nature. It's the best way to do it. Melatonin will change your life. Here are some of the great things on research from an abstract study that I just ran across by leading experts in melatonin. It including one of the most powerful antioxidants, anti-cancer, anti-tumor, anti-inflammatory, anti-aging, anti-diabetic, antiviral, neuroprotective activities. Also, there are numerous studies, scientific reports on the therapeutic potential of melatonin in treatment of asthma, upper respiratory tract diseases, COVID-19, chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, COPD, lung cancer, uh, even actually for any cavities. It is a systematic review of the therapeutic potential of melatonin in the treatment of respiratory diseases along with the molecular mechanism of action. Melatonin is a substance we should be taking every day, especially as we age in the 30s and the 40s. We are producing almost no melatonin. And remember, melatonin is only produced as darkness occurs through the day. So we don't let that happen. Light stops the production of melatonin. So as we turn on our screens, we turn on, on TVs, we turn on our, our cell phones, uh, we go to bed and we can't sleep, so we turn the TV on while we're in bed. Uh, all this lighting actually stops the production and the inhibition of melatonin. Even if we go to bed and we fall asleep, but we might have to get up and use the bathroom. As we go to the bathroom, we turn on the light. Melatonin stops production. So that's why we have such an inhibition of melatonin in our lifetime. And one of the most critical factors known for all kinds of medical diseases. So if we want to stop and prevent diseases and reverse those diseases, food is the number one medicine. Food is our medicine. We've had food as our medicine for two million years. We've had medicines and drugs for maybe the last 100 years. Which do you think works better, nature or drugs? I would follow nature, and food is your best medicine. Top that off with substances like melatonin to reverse all your diseases and stop and prevent diseases and add some of these other wonderful nutrients as well. You can become well. I don't care how old you are. I don't care what condition you're in. You can change in a matter of weeks to months, truly. We may have spent decades abusing our body. And if we haven't destroyed something in the process, we can reverse that. We can actually change our lifestyle, change our whole chemistry within a matter of weeks to days. That's including cholesterol, triglycerides, the blood pressure. All that can become normal if we change our lifestyle to a lifestyle of natural foods, natural supplements, natural botanical extracts as our medicines. So you can change your life. And if you want to know more, follow me.
Follow me on Facebook, TerryTalksNutrition.com. You can follow me on podcast with, Doc, with Terry and Dr. Lynn on the podcast. You can follow me at YouTube, Terry Talks Nutrition. You can follow me in a lot of different places to get more information. So if you want to be healthier, just follow me. God bless you and God bless America.